my, I'm Linda Bowman. I'm president of the Community College of Aurora, and I'm very happy uh, that you came to hear about our partnership, and I thank Joe Wagner and his entire team. I want to just let could you, you know... Could you describe that partnership a little bit, because there, uh, I certainly have not... I, I was told about it, but maybe you could tell us a little more about it, because I think it's the future of what we do about the displaced worker situation. Please go ahead. Well, I'm delighted to do that. We actually offer a diesel technology program at our Lowry campus here in Aurora, wherein the students are sponsored by Wagner Equipment to come in. They serve not only as students, but as apprentices for Wagner. So they are on the job as well as in school. We bring in math and science and English faculty who work with them within their learning environment, learning technology. It's a very high tech program. And Wagner has supplied equipment. They've provided faculty to us. They have done so many things. Caterpillar is a, pro a major partner also. And what I want to share with you and is... Could I just add, what's the success rate here? Success rate is unbelievable because these students have already got the job when they come into this program. They're already part of the Wagner uh, family when they join the Community College of Aurora family. What's so important about this is these kinds of programs only exist when we make these kinds of huge investments like Wagner has made. And as a country, we aren't making those investments nearly at the rate that we need to do. And, you know, we're in danger. Our generation is going to be the first where our children are less educated than we are. So I just really um, want to thank you for your comments about community colleges and ask you whatever we can do to further invest in making sure that U.S. is competitive. I think we've got to do it this way. Thank you very much, and thank you for your great work. And thank you, Joe. Thank you for your investment. But I, I, and I just want to say to you again, the centerpiece of our addressing the issue of the displaced worker, and we all know that because of foreign competition and the fleeing of manufacturing jobs, we have lost in hundreds of thousands of jobs in America. And we need, I believe, to make the centerpiece of our job retraining and education program exactly what you're doing. Exactly what you're doing, but I think that the government should sponsor these programs so that you don't have to be as large a company or corporation as we have here at Wagner. In other words, if you've got a business and you're a small business person and you need the, a, a person who is trained and educated in a certain specialty, you ought to be able to say the community college. I need, I need a trained and educated worker in my particular field and provide that opportunity. And I would even say that while a person who is an older worker is out of a job and is at, your, at Aurora Community College, I would be glad to supplement their income. Supplement their income if they're having to do, have a low paying job while they're uh, uh, undergoing education and training. And I say that as a small government, less regulation, lower taxes person, because we know a job is more than a job.